Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a full face of Shop Miss A makeup. I have a whole bin here from foundation to a brows, um, lips, everything. So if you're interested in seeing the look I can make out of this $1 makeup, then you're in the right place and just keep on watching. Alright, so first I'm going to start by priming my face and I'm going to be using the AOA Studio Wonder Skin Poreless Primer. And next is foundation. I'm going to go in with the Amuse 3-in-1 foundation stick. And I have this in the shade Pecan. Ooh. This is a... I'm just going to draw all over my face with this because that's what you got to do to mash it and get it out. I'm going to try to blend this out with the AOA Studio F4 brush. Um, I'm going to try to go in with the Amuse Pro Matte Foundation, and this is in the shade Nude Beige. I'm just going to squeeze a little bit out, because I have a feeling this is not going to work either. Let me try that first. I gave it a little bit more coverage than this one had. Let me add some more. Yeah, this foundation definitely is helping a little bit more. So I'm just gonna go do the rest of my face of foundation. And I'll be right back. Alright, next is concealer. I have two different concealers here. I have the Santee 2-in-1 Foundation and Concealer. And this is in the shade Nude. And then I have the AOA Studio Wonder Cover in the shade Porcelain. So I think I'm going to try both of them. Um, but for my under eyes, I think I'm just going to go with the Nude one. Just be sure because this looks really light. Okay, so this here is the concealer. And this is in the shade Nude. Ooh, too much, too much, too much. All right. All right this is the... Oh, Nude is a little light for me. But, okay. We're just going to put it under the eye. And I don't think I have a concealer brush. Nope, I will just use the blender. Ooh, that's a little light. Okay, uh, I'm gonna try to go in with this shade porcelain. Uh, I'm 
not going to go crazy because it's definitely light, but maybe it's a little bit more full coverage than the other one. Oh yeah, more coverage. To set my face into place, I'm going to be using the Santee Mineral Compact. And this is in the shade 03 Beige. And I'm just going to be using their um, powder brush in AOA Studio F12. I'm just going to... Next, I'm going to go ahead and just do my brows. I have two different products. I have the Amuse Extra Brow Pencil Matte Long Lasting. And I got this in the shade Brunette. And then I have the Santee Eyebrow Designer in the shade Black Brown. And these here are the swatches. And honestly, I think I'm going to go with the Black Brown shade just because um, it looks like it would fit my brow better than the brunette. Right, so I'm just going to comb my brows using the AOA Studio uh, Brow Spoolie. I always almost say smoothie every time and I meant spoolie, but sometimes I just, I don't say it right. You know, nobody's perfect, you know? She's really dark. I gotta go with the light hand. Oh man. Oh, I hope I can fix that. Oh my god. Oh no. That's really sucks. All right, I did my brows. I had to clean them up because oof, they were even worse than they are now. They are a little bit dark, but it is okay. I'm just gonna set this over here. By the way, if you guys see me reaching over here, that is because all of my Shop Missé brushes are in this um, acrylic container. Um, I used the black brown and then I went in with the clean color um, brow something. I don't know, it was a kit and it came with like stencils and stuff. But because that is so waxy, I used this to set it down a little bit. Um, Alright, next I'm going to go and do my eyes, and I have two different eyelid primers. Um, first I have do my eyes now, and I'm going to, uh, I don't know, I have the Clean Color Eyeshadow um, Matte Primer. And then I also picked up the Santee Long Lasting Eyeshadow Base. Uh, I don't know, let me look at the... Consistencies. Mm. That's like a. Oh no, I don't like that. I'm gonna go in with the matte one. All right, and to prime my eyes, I'm gonna go in with the clean color. Um, matte primer. I'm just gonna. To set it, I'm going to go in with the Makeup Essentials Contour Kit and I'm going to take this shade right here it is more like a nudie banana shade and I'm gonna use the AOA Studio E101 brush no I'm not I'll be using the AOA Studio F15 foundation brush 
There we go. That's picking it up way better. That's better, yes. Make sure All right. For my transition shade, I think I'm going to go in with this color right here in the Makeup Essentials Contour Kit. Or no, I'm going to go in with this one right here. Wait, did I call this a transition shade? I think I did. I meant freaking crease shade. What the fuck? Oh, that's pretty. Alright, and to deepen up a little bit, I'm gonna go in with this one right here. I'm gonna put this in my outer V and then blend it into my crease. You can even tell it's there. Not really. Barely bit up my crease even more. I'm gonna go in with the Alpha Win in Cancun palette. Um I think I'm gonna go in with this brown right here. This is actually a brow, like an eyebrow brown, so I've never used this one. It's not really showing up. Hmm. Don't worry about the messiness, we will clean that up. I'm going with the middle shade actually. Right, to deepen up my crease a little bit more, I'm going to go into the Amuse, um, I don't know, one of the Amuse palettes. I'm going to take this black right here. Look at that. Like pigment. Boom. I'm going to go into the Santi Silky Touch 6 Shadow palette. And it looks like this. And I'm going to take this color right here. And I'm just going to rub it on my finger because my brushes never seem to pick it up. And I'm just going to carefully rub it on there. And I'm going to that same palette and I'm going to take the color right here. And I'm actually going to put that right in the the center of my lid. Well, this is just not going well. I am not a fan of their eyeshadows right now. Alright, I'm gonna take the little white color that's in there. I'm gonna set that in my inner corner. I'm gonna do that to the other eye. So, my eyeliner is done. I had to do it three times. I'm not doing it again. It's 4 19 in the morning. I'm not gonna do it again. Just not. I'm just gonna keep on going. Keep it moving. All right, yeah. time to contour. Now I'm gonna go into the Makeup Essentials kit again, and I'm gonna take this one. Is it this one? Yeah, it's this one right here. And I'm gonna contour using the F14 contour brush.
Ooh. I don't want it to look like I'm dirty. I went okay. ahead and just did my mascara and everything off camera because the mascara I have is not from Shop Masse. However, it is drugstore and it is the um, Maybelline Pumped Up Colossal Volume Express Mascara. This is only like $5 at Walmart or any drugstore. So, yes. So, the um, eyeliner is by Amuse, and it is this to be thing right here, in case you are wondering. Alright, so for blush, I'm going to go in to the Amuse Duo Kit, and I'm going to take this blush right here, and this is in the shade 2, I think. Yeah, it's 2. And I'm going to take the... F13, which is a pretty good blush brush, and I'm going to take it as a light hand because that is a lot. Mm. I don't want to look like I got punched in the face, so... Oh god, okay, 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 I didn't... F did I fixed it? I fixed it. Looks okay. Looks okay. Now on to the highlighter. I'm gonna go into the Rainbow Pearl A2O. Looks like this. I'm gonna highlight. And I'm gonna take the F19, which is the highlighter brush. And I'm gonna try to drag it like right here at the bottom. So that's where. I get the most of the highlighter that I like. Very powdery. So watch out. Yes. I'm gonna push it out a little bit. lips. How my lipsticks are in this bag that I also got from Shop Messe. So we're gonna go through them. Bing. Alright, I'm just gonna nude my lips with uh, a little bit of foundation. And I'm gonna go in with the Amuse um, liquid lipstick and this is in the shade 9. Does it say 9? Yeah. It's in the shade 9. It's like a purpley brown pretty color. It's really pretty. Oh shit. Alright guys, that is the final look. I just added some of the same highlighter I used here. The Rainbow Veal. Um, so yeah, I know my eye makeup is like terrible, but I mean, my highlighter is popping, so ignore everything else, right? Alright guys, so, yeah. that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, don't forget to give the video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe before you go. And until next time, I love you guys.